Hey, hello and welcome to today's uh, problem of the day. Uh, GFG problem of the day, isomorphic strings. First of all, a very happy Diwali to all of you. Uh, so let's quickly see what the problem has to say. Uh, given two strings, str1 and str2, check if these two strings are isomorphic to each other. If the characters in str1 can be changed to get str2, then two strings, str1 and str2, are isomorphic. A character must be completely swapped out for another character while maintaining the order of the characters. A character may map to itself, but no two characters may map to the same character. Okay. So let's uh, quickly see through the examples. Okay. What the problem is trying to say. So let's take an example. If this is string one and this is string two. So what uh, the problem is saying is um, we have to uh, check whether a st whether the strings are isomorphic strings or not. That is, if we're, by replacing the characters in str1 with str2, are we able, are these two strings isomorphic or not? Are completely replaceable or not? Right? So let's see. So if we replace a with x, okay, so the string becomes, this str1 becomes xab, right? If uh, again, we encounter this uh, A, right? What we did, A, we replaced A with X. So the string has become XAB. Now again, we encounter A, right? And again, earlier we had uh, uh, replaced A with X only. So this is acceptable. So what this string becomes now? XXB, right? XXB, okay? And then we encounter, we encounter this B, and we see that, okay, B is uh, not yet uh, uh, come into the picture. So we will, we can replace this. So X, X, Y. So STR1 is completely, uh, is converted to X, X, Y successfully. So this is isomorphic, true, right? What the problem is saying is what we cannot do, right? What we cannot do. So we can see an example here, A, A, B, and X, Z, Y, right? So we replace A with X. Okay, here done, it becomes XAB, right? Now we encounter A again, but this time, but this time, A is mapping to Z, but earlier we had mapped A with X. So we cannot do this. We cannot, the problem says we cannot do this because we had earlier mapped to A to X. We cannot do the, the same character cannot be mapped to another character in string two. Okay. So this is false. This, these are not isomorphic. Okay. Let me take this little down. Then again, another thing, what we cannot do, right? What we cannot do. Similarly, if uh, let's say uh, B with X, right? So we replace B with X. Okay. So what the string one becomes? X A D. But here, now we, now we come to A, right? Now what we're saying that we have to replace A with X. We cannot do this as well because we had replaced B with X. Okay. So these are two different characters. Two different characters cannot be mapped to the same character. So here it is written. Two characters may map to, uh, but two different characters. Two different characters cannot be mapped to the same character. Okay. So again, this is not isomorphic. Okay. This is not isomorphic. Okay, so let's take an example, uh, uh, an isomorphic example here P with T. So R, uh, it becomes T A P E R, right? Then A with I, yes, P with T we replaced A with I. Let's take T I P E R, right? P with T, yes, earlier we see, okay, P was replaced with T only. So here P with T, we can definitely replace this. So it becomes T I P E R, right? Then E. With L, yes, E we have not encountered here uh, earlier. So we can do this T, I, T, L and R. Then again, we come to R and R, right? R and E, right? So R has not come across yet. Also, E has not come here, right? For, an, uh, for any other character. So definitely we can replace T, I, T, L, E. So this is isomorphic, we can say. Right? This is isomorphic, we can say. Okay, so simple two conditions that this one we have to uh, uh, see that okay, 
the two characters right the two characters may should map to same character only if there are two same characters they should map to same character only here okay and the other condition is the other condition is no two different characters can map to the same character okay uh, okay so these are the two conditions we have to take care of and definitely one simple case is the length of the two strings right the length of the two strings has to be same they cannot be different otherwise they won't be isomorphic okay so okay so what we can do here right what we can do is we can have a map we can have a map and whenever we encounter right whenever we encounter uh, the characters will see whether the uh, will see right whether the characters are there or not okay so let's quickly take this example okay let's take an example uh, a right we we come uh, we iterate through a and what we do we insert the replacement of the string 2 as a value okay a to x right a to x okay a a b and x x y okay this now again we come here to a and we see okay if a is there or not in the map yes it is there and it is mapping to the same character it is mapping to the same character so this is acceptable okay we'll just move ahead b and y so here we see is b there no b is not there so we'll simply so we'll simply put b and y okay and yes we are done so we'll return true okay now take this example what another uh, uh, we have to handle another case right so uh, a a b and then um, x y z right x y z so yes we'll iterate through a right a okay we'll put it simply a and x now again we come to a now what we'll have to check okay but what we'll have to check over here is a okay now we come a but we had replaced a with x and now here it is saying that it is y right so this these two are not matching these two are not matching and will simply return false right let's see the third third case now third example right what the example was b a d right and x x y right so we'll iterate uh, through this we'll put b and x here now we come here a right but we already see but we already see okay a is not there a is not there in the map but we see whether this value whether this value has is there or not in the map in the in the values of the map whether it is there or not yes it is there right it is there okay so that is why that is why this cannot be isomorphic see we we told two conditions right that here the two characters the uh, same character same character if it is appearing twice okay it has to be mapped with the same other character right a a a a b and x x y right x x y so it has to map to the same character right and second b a d you cannot do this x x y right x x y if you had replaced b with x then you cannot replace other character in the string one with the same character x okay so what we have to check is what we have to check is first in the map when we put when we come across a to x right and we again encounter the same character okay so this the uh, uh, the re the replacement has to be the same with the other character in uh, string 2 okay similarly here okay even if we we had put b with x right b and x here and we encounter a a is not there in the map but we have to also check whether this this value this value if it is already there Yes, it is there in, in our case, if this value, right, it is already there in the map, but it is mapped with some other character, right? So again, this is not isomorphic, we have to, we have to return false, okay? So this is a, a solution. We can, let's quickly dry run. I've already implemented this, okay? So here, first of all, the case was definitely the, uh, if the length of the two strings are not same, then we have to return false. Then we take a hash map, okay? What we do is uh, we took the original character first and the replacement from str2 and we are checking, right? If it is, if this original, right? If this original 
it is there or not right it is uh, uh, it is not there good if it is not there then here we are checking the in the value section right so in this case right so here right b a d x x y so here what we did let's say we had put b and x now we are checking whether it is there or not a is there or not right so here we are checking here if a is there or not a is not there in a case in the map right it is coming true but you here again we are checking m dot contains value replacement replacement and if we consider replacement as x right this x but here what we are checking we are checking the values values section right whether this has appeared or not in in this case in this case this would have appeared x would have appeared so we would have written false right but if it is not appeared definitely we'll put in the map and we'll proceed ahead okay we'll proceed ahead to the next characters now okay now let's look into this this condition right let's look into this condition so this condition was this a a b and x x y right a a b and x x y so we let's say we did not find this one right we did not find this one uh okay yeah so yes for example let's say uh <clears throat> okay yeah, so for example yes 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 so in this case right so let's say a and x so we had put in the map a and x right now we encounter this right a the second character we see whether it is in the map or not so this is the case see here this original character was found in the map so it will come here right and then we are checking okay what was the replacement uh, in this a was replaced with x and here replacement again is x here only right right x again if it was not x if so it, if it was like this a a b x y z right so in this case so this would not have matched because we had mapped a with x and now it is saying y right so we would have written false and then if everything is good everything is matching then we return true okay so this is the solution let's submit it So yes, it is accepted. I hope you've got the problem and the solution. Thanks for watching. Kindly like the video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.